Hello everybody and welcome back to the YouTube channel. Um, so I know it's been a long time since I've recorded a video. Well, I've, I've uploaded one a few, a few weeks ago, but that was actually recorded back in, I think, maybe it might even be like April time or May. So it's been a long, long time since I've uploaded. Um, purely because of just workload at the moment with college and life stuff in general. So, but yeah, I'm continue, continue to upload stuff, but just at my own pace. So it'll be slower uploads, and I'll just upload basically whenever I have the opportunity to record and edit something. Um, I've also got other projects on at the moment, so that takes up a bit of my time. But at the end of the day, I want this to be my primary channel, so this will take the forefront. And anyway, let's just jump into the game. So today we're playing Subnautica. I've been meaning to play this on the channel for a long time. I've got the sequel as well, bought and ready to go whenever we finish this game. But and, uh, I bought this, I had this game for years. I got it when it first came on Xbox, and I've played the majority of it. But um, I want to start sc from scratch because it's been so long since I played the first bit anyway, and I wanted to get the whole playthrough on my channel. And I, I think that's what I'm gonna have to do anyway now because my old this is my creative thing. I just wanted to see there for 24 minutes. I did have a, a save that was like days worth, but I think it's just gone somehow. So yeah, not the best, but we will just crack on with a new game anyway, is what I was planning to do. So let's just jump straight into it. Um, right, let's look at the game settings. I think, yeah, we're just gonna play a regular survival. Let's jump into it. Press any Okay. Oops. Gas explosion. <laughs> oh, it appears I've been twatted in the face. <laughs> I need to save my one, like, one kilometer, one cubic meter of fucking space. Wow, I'm so glad I've saved this little floating hut. That's a chair for a lot of tune, considering I've just, like, pretty much everyone's just died around me. Okay, so as long as it's not major. This PDA has Very now awful. rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. I think I'm going to need that luck, to be honest. Right. So we're going to get through the tutorial. Oh, and then that's all we get, I think. So it's medkit. Very important. Uh, in here. Oh, there is. Uh, I'll come back for them if I need, need them. Actually, yeah, mm. yeah I should be fine for now. I'm not too sure, because it's been such a long time since I've uh, done this. But obviously, I know the fabricator is probably the most useful thing. Um, we have nothing though, so I'm going to have to go outside the pod, I think. The Aurora suffered orbital hull failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. It's always a cheerful, uh, cheerful thing to find out that, isn't it? When you've just crashed, that you're probably the only survivor. Okay. In for a dip. Wow. 
Wow. These are ugly, ugly little things. But I want one. It's gonna be my pet for the playthrough now. <laughs> oh dear, dear, dear. Right, let's get some food. Can't eat you. Cannot eat you. Ladder fish like the most important fish. But I'm only want to use them sparingly. Unexpected applications. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. New creature yes, discovered. I know. Oh, oxygen. Uh, I forgot you just don't have much oxygen when you start the game. <laughs> right, we need to find some minerals. It's about the minerals, Marie! Pick up some quartz. Ooh, and an egg. I can't do anything with that yet, but I want it anyway. I'll be some creature eggs. Um, quartz is used for glass, I think, from memory. Uh, oh, yeah, oh, this is actually a tutorial thing, I didn't realise. You break these from mineral deposits and you get random minerals. Well, they're not random, um, but like, I think you can get like different types in certain ones. Back down we go. I'll have to head back to the pod in a minute though to get um, some food. There's another egg. Yeah. Uh, I just need to make sure I don't take too many eggs, because I never when I played the first playthrough I had just chests upon chests full. Want, I want this fish. Please, please can I have the fish. Please, please can I have the fish. Please can I have this baby fish. Please, please, please can I have the fish. Thank you. Now, we're not going to discuss the, the, the nature of that fish. It looks a bit sus. Some people would use that fish for some very... Uh, activities to say the least. Oh no. Alright. We need a new like air tank ASAP because we just barely spend any time down here at all. Um here we go. What am I picking up this is titanium isn't it? The titanium? Yes. Titanium. Copper's like wires I think in this. Well it is in real life as well I suppose but we're gonna have a sauce fish. Detecting sulfur deposits in the local cave systems. Oh shit. Sulfur is an um. essential component of the repair tool. Oh, no, no, I can hear it. Run, 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 just a, just a self-destructing fish. But uh, yeah, they, they like guard like sulfur deposits and you need sulfur for certain things, so we're going to have to find more of them. That fish also just reminds you of Jar Jar Binks, so I'm going to have to nick one of them again. Right, where, was, where was he actually hiding? I need his sulfur. Here it is. Right, this is where they come out of. And then they have the sulfur in the pods. So, we need to be careful of them. Uh, you do have to the surface now. Oxygen. Yeah, somewhere. Oh dear, I thought that was to get out. Oh no, I'm going to drown. Oh dear, this is not good. I'm probably going to die instantly. <laughs> Great start to the playthrough. Let's go. I thought there was a cave exit, but there was not. It was just artificial light somehow. And that's why you don't bring out the really good food of you. Saucy fish. Let's go find our stuff. I swear, you, I, I I hope you can pick it back up. I hope. I never really died in the first when I first played the game though, so I don't really know. Oh, yeah, you can because this is all the shit I had on me. Have I lost all the fish? Where's my stuff? No. Where's the rest of my stuff? I've literally lost, like, so, like permanently lost some of my stuff. Because if I have, I'm annoyed. Well, here's the egg I had. Oxygen. <sighs> what a conundrum. I've got, like, no titanium now as well, and that's literally what I went for. I don't have the sulfur either, do I? 
Oh no, I do have the sulfur. That's the most. That's the most like. That's the hardest resource to get back. But um. Oh, where is some titanium? There's only one still though. Oh, there's some more down here. Where's my floater friend as well? I think my floater friend's gone. Which is really sad. I think I'll get myself another one. This is, this is the primary objective. My main goal. Oh, you need to be careful of that myself, because those will like, blow up and like gas me out. But they are useful for certain things, I think. Um, I think you need them to like build certain weapons. But, but, like, like, like I know you need them for like gas torpedoes when you get like certain suits. Oh, yeah, this, is my, this is my stuff here. Some of it, I think. Lovely. Alright, let's go pick up this bladderfish. Come here. Bladderfish are really, really New useful. Creature discovered. Gary. What a Gary fish. Perhaps I'll keep a, perhaps I'll keep a Gary as well. One thing you'll, you'll, you'll come to find about me in this game is that I just love quite just stealing all the animals. I want to make a massive aquarium in this playthrough. And I think one of the most important things to breed is the bladder fish. Because at the moment that's my only way of getting water. <laughs> right. Right, yeah, we can pick up these as well, can't we? Like, really good for titanium, metal salvage. So let's go into the ship. Actually, I want to take some peepers of me or some fish to cook. Some dindins. Right, what can we make? Um, repair tool that we need as well. Um, I need silicone for that. That's pretty easy to get, I think. Um, so the first things first. Probably it was just an actual O2 tank. So I can breathe longer. There we go. I've pretty much doubled my breathing capacity already. Which is brilliant. Wait, what's, what's, what do you have a knife? I need rubber for that as well. Okay. Basically, you need to get a bunch of rubber. Some more titanium. Some glass. Copper wire. Right, let's get some food. Let's cook some fish. The fabricator cooks small organisms for while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them mm -mm -mm. safe for human consumption. Yum. Let's put the egg in there, in this egg. Sulfur, put the floater, and let's put Gary in there. And the fire extinguisher, we don't need that yet. Um, and then we'll dump off some of this as well, probably. Uh, well, I, I can eat the fish, and this one. And then we've got like full food. Let's chuck some of the quartz in here. Actually, I can I'll, chuck, I'll chuck all of it in there because I don't need it in, when I'm out. Uh, yeah, I think that's about right. Uh, I don't know. Actually, I don't want to risk the bladder fish escaping, so I'll put them in there first. Primarily. <clears throat> oh dear, it's dark now. Um, right, let's go into this. Into the, the kelp. Forests over here. It's very scary. This game is a very scary game at times. Um, I was about to say, we need to be careful of the stalkers. It's like big shark looking things. Oh, there's one. Once you get better at the game, oh, another one there. Uh, once you get better at the game, like better stuff, you don't really. Get worried about them, but considering I've got literally nothing to defend myself with. Oh dear, I think one's going after me. Is he? Lawyer stoned. Life on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. Hmm. I shall study the hell out of this planet. Local radiation levels. 
Trent is it's not good either. Damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during planet fall. So that's going to be a problem we have to fix soon, probably. Let's get some more of this. Right, let's go. I don't want to be around that, those sharks any longer. Ooh, I want this new fish. <laughs> Girlfriend. Look at him. Or two little fella. Right. What can we do? Uh, we need silicone, so let's make a bunch of this. Right, 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 right here, right here. What can I do this now? I need to make uh, fins are probably important, so I can swim faster. The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate equipment using locally available materials. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. Um, we will need the repair tool, so we can repair the life pod. And let's get the knife, which doesn't do much, but you know it can be used for help. Following the massacre on Braxis Prime, the knife remains the only exception. Right, let's repair the life pod. I actually remember what this does, I just know I think it gives it light and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, there we go. Nice. But we do need this radio though. We do indeed need this radio. Let's repair it. This is where we find out about like survivors and things like that, I think, or pot where the life pods are. Reassuring, again, really reassuring. Basically, we're done for on our own. Um, right, what else? What are we, what are we gonna need? We're going to need. Where's a scanner? A scanner would need a battery. What? How, how do you make a battery? Oh, acid mushrooms. Okay. Let's go get some acid mushrooms. I know where they are. There's a bunch over here. So we can start scanning stuff. And batteries are very useful. For like pretty much everything in this. Because you need power. Like you see now the repair tool above the hotbar. It's at 92%. And we need to keep the batteries charged. Um, mm -mm -mm. Can I make a battery now? Yes. Let's go. Scanner. The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to record alien biological data. So very important. Um, what about food? Oh, I don't want to cut this little guy. He's so cute. Look at him. Ah, oh, you want bless him. <laughs> right. Um. Can we just, just let's just pay attention to this real quickly. <laughs> what on earth? No, stay, stand, stand, stand still, please. I don't know which one I'm scanning. The floater. <laughs> Lovely. Oh my lord. Right. I want to scan the bladder fish. Okay, there we go. Let's, let's have a look at this, have a look at the floater, shall we? Uh, they attach, so they attach onto objects to feed off them. Nice. That is really lovely. Right, let's just chuck that one back away, because we've already got one. 
Don't need another one. Bye. Let's get let's, let's get the peeping tom. Well, I would do if it did, if it stopped running away. We need to get titanium. Is what we need. So let's go get that. Do we, can we? Oh, actually, yeah. We need. To, we do need. We do need this sea glide asap though. So if any more fragments of that, we need to scan them. Uh, what on earth are you? A sh shuttle bug. Hmm. Mouth parts. I'd rather not learn about your mouth parts. Sorry, pal. Let's scan ourselves. Why don't we? Vital signs normal. Continuing to monitor. Thirty seconds. It's good to know, isn't it? We are completely normal. You feel like you feel you know, like I'm hearing the, the the stalker, but I just never see it. Where is it? Oh, there is one. It's got some metal salad actually as well, so I want oh I did want that, but I also want to breathe. And back down we go. Where is that metal gone? That's got it's got a lot of titanium. Four to be exact. Four whole pieces. Oh. This is a store crag, I think. I want it. It's an egg of some sort. Ooh, metal right, let's scan the metal salvage. I'm pretty sure this gives us the titanium out, right? Does it? No. I was just chatting out my bum, really. My god, there's so much here. Um, well, we need to come back for this because that's really useful. But I did see this over here. Uh, what's this? Ooh, vehicle bay. I thought it would be a part of the sea glide. This is still very useful if I can actually search it. Thank you. Maybe three more of them. Um, where are the store? Oh, there's one over here. Oh, here we go. Is that, is that sea glide? Yeah, let's go. Now we can actually get places in a decent amount of time. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me, but I want to scan you. I want to scan you and add you to my database. I need to breathe. Need to breathe. Need to breathe. Oh dear. I think he's trying to eat me. I need to get. I need to get better at breathing. It's like it's not easy to get back to the surface when you when you've got a sea glide. So we need to go make that like like now. But first, I do want to scan you. Where have you gone? Also, this gives you air. I could I could have just come over here. Thinking about it. That would have been the smart idea. Um, oh, there he is. Come here, buddy. He's got more metal salvage again. He's helped me out here quite a lot. Oh, I've got a radio thing going off as well, so I think that means there's a thing for me at, the, at my, my pod. Oh, oh dear. Don't eat me, please. Just go after me. Thirty seconds. Mate, you do not want this smoke. I'm telling you now. Yeah, that's what I thought. Bear. That's what I thought. Right. Let's, let's go. Yeah, you get some weird noises from the gastropods here. I'm telling you now. Right. Rabbit Ray. I, 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 want, I actually want one of these. Can I just have one of these in real life? Look at it. Look at it. Look how cute it is. Thank you. Yoink. Alright, we can hopefully now make two things. I think we can make... I am going to check that radio in a minute, but let's get the important stuff out of the way first. Um, oh yeah, that's what we need lubricant for. Okay. Well, let's get a waterproof locker. Oh yeah, it's time. I think. Wait, why am I in here? Pathfinder tool. Uh Oh. That's pretty useful. I don't think I ever used that. I didn't even realize it was a thing. Right, let's get a sea glide. Probably one of the probably the most useful tool in the game. We'll increase your effective exploration range. For your safety, please yep. pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five of the nearest life or <laughs> This is my This is my favourite dude though, look at him. Oh, We'll cook the other one. Uh, hope poop fish. Sorry, pal. 
but I'm hungry. I am hungry, hungry, hungry. Thank you. Uh, we got to. Oh, we need. We got to make this part fish into some water as well. We are looking rather parched. Um, that was rotten now as well. Brilliant. Oh, I did not mean to eat it. Oh, <laughs> oh why have I eaten it? Right, yeah, what, what, I forgot what we're doing. We've got to go out here and deploy the locker. Deploy the locker. Uh, drop. Okay, that looks like that'll do. We're gonna need more of these, I think, now. Because I just hoard a bunch of stuff. That's probably not a good thing to happen. I'm sorry, Gary, but you're looking rather tasty. Right, we're gonna cook Gary. We're gonna read. We're gonna uh, listen to the radio. I was gonna say read the radio. I don't think that's an option. Uh, where's Gary? Sorry, it's Gary. Common for those accustomed to synthetic foods to be repulsed by eating an animal carcass. Remember that humans survived this way for millennia. You can too. And I will. I have no remorse. Let's go. This is LifePod 3, uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide, so if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Ooh, potential survivor. Right. Out we go. Where are we going? We're going this way. Meow. Oh, here we are. That was a short journey. I know see I think it just gives me titanium. Yeah, nice. Um, let's go in here. Got a data pad, is it? Video. Um, what's this? Compass. Again, I don't think I ever used the compass, so I didn't even realize it was a thing in the game. Might, might be useful. Mm, probably won't be, but we'll find out. Um, right. Well, that's that then. They, but I don't know how they died. Like, you, you were literally around the corner from me, pal. Get your act together. Meow. I was preparing for a whole ass big journey then, but didn't need to apparently. Um, uh, oh, oh, behave. Oh, he wants beef. Oh, there's two of them. Uh, uh. Yeah, I think we need to go searching for more blueprints. That's probably our best option right now. Um, let's cook one of these fish. Saw the guy in a hot bar, don't worry. Still got him. Of unsavory meat with salt or locally sourced herbs and spices. Close little fella. He yawns. Oh, bless him. How he's still alive, we don't know. Because he's been out of the water for a long time. But he's staying with us now. Let's, let's have a look at Gary as well. Let's get Gary out. Oh, there he is, Gary. <laughs> Look at this little fella. Ah. No, oh, I did not mean to. Look at that floater, it's attached off to a peeper now. What the? I have never seen a sky ray before. Are you crazy? No, let me scan you. Let's go. Now we need to be looking for more blueprints. Where are they going to be? Right, if these stalkers don't try and eat me, which I, they are chasing me. Mm. Oh, come on then. Oh, this isn't affected with something. Ugh.
Why is he infected? <laughs> I got bitten by him as well. That's not the best, is it? Alright, we've got a radio signal again, so we're gonna go back to that now, but... Can I just kill him? We must stop the risk of infection spreading. Come back here, boy. Actually, no, no, no point in me doing this. I don't think. I'm just doing the community if I ever. If I can actually, if, if I can actually kill one, then it's. Is he dead? Oh yeah, he's dead. I think. Maybe. Oxygen. Surely, surely he's dead. Surely he's dead. Surely he's dead. I think he's dead, but the game is not registered that he's dead. Oh, well, we got a pet now. Pet, dead, stalker, even though he's not dead. Yeah, you know, that's a really weird sentence, I never thought I'd have to say. In context, it makes sense, I promise. Right. Um, I mean, sulfur probably still at some point as well. But that's not a big priority at the moment. I do. Wanna, I do want to kind of show you what the what the that they actually look like though, when they come out. It's really creepy. Whole fish, saucy fish. Mm mm mm, saucy fish for dindons. Oxygen. Oxygen. Mm-mm-mm, saucy fish for dindins. Look at me, I've got 105, 106 hunger. I'm above, I'm above the pay grade. Right. Player Distress call. This is Ozzy from the cafeteria. What the hell, guys? They didn't warn us this might happen. Our pod was almost crushed by the Seamoth Bay on the way down. Now we're hanging on the edge of a cave system, and this grim-looking snake thing's trying to eat through the hull. Come get us already! Signal location uploaded to PDA. You know, I'm a good guy and all, but... I don't know if going against a snake-looking thing that easy, that's managing to eat your hull is a wise decision on my part in terms of surviving, so... But hey, we're not, we're not, we're not smart here, so we're gonna go anyway. Also, where's that? That's, that's gonna happen. I'm gonna eat him by a snake. Yeah, not too bad. These... These um, other survivors really need to get good, really. Like, realistic. Oh, hello. There's a new one. Speedfish. Obviously, I've seen you before, but. Ow! I like seeing them again. Oh, and these things. These are so annoying. These are worse than stalkers, and they're only a small. Like, I'm, I'm gonna kill this thing in a minute if it carries on. I just wanna scan you, bro. The names are literally biting. <laughs> Ah, uh, leave me alone. Scans suggest this biome supports extensive biome diversity and connects to a number of small cave networks. Now that might sound cool, but when you think about what really they just said, is that oh, I forgot what these sand sharks. That these actually are apparently sharks. Um, oh, no, 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 please, please, no. Oh. <laughs> Away from me. Get away. Is that what they meant by a snake thing? It's not really a snake thing, is it? They need to get better at descriptive words. Integrated is there actually anything for me to have? Plus? TV? Can I, can, I, can I steal the TV? No. Probably not. Any wreckage? Oh, yeah. Ooh. They're treating me to a Seamoth fragment. Yum. 
Oh my god. Right. I'm literally hitting you. Can you? Oh. Oh, that looks safe. Don't eat me, I just want to scan you. <laughs> Too slow. <laughs> oh, damn it. Run. Da -na -na -na. Ooh, ooh, and that's a different fragment that's not seem off. Still gonna scan it though. Oh, wait, we need one fragment. Okay. See, I hope this poke through. I'll have to use stuff I never used before because I didn't use that either. Well, last one. Ooh, this is a new one again. Regin Reginald? What a posh fish. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency. Oh, decreased. okay. Yeah, let's not go down there yet. Let's just not. I don't think that's where I want to go. Warning. Local Can I? Radiation oh. readings suggest the Aurora's drive core has reached critical state. Quantum detonation will occur within two hours. Oh, yeah. Only quantum detonation. First, though, that's so cool. But here we have a behemoth. These things are. The biggest teddy bears of the ocean. Oh, it's not a behemoth, it's a reef back. I can't even get the name right. It looks like straight out of a halo. 30 seconds. But they are. Just don't. They don't do anything bad to you at all. They just kind of chill. Although there are some things on the back of it though, like that, like try and shoot you. I think like plants. Congratulations, survivor. You have exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by 500 percent. What can I say? Oh, you see, I don't have much of an option to do that when I have to do that pace around my little life pod. Okay, right, let's go down here. Ooh, lots of stuff to scan. Lots and lots of stuff. Oh, yeah, never see moth bit. <gasps> Ooh, I think I can get a see moth now. Because there's another one here as well. Let's go. Go to see moth. Acquired. We have acquired new blueprint. Oh, oh, you need to just. Are you dead? Oh yeah, I killed it. Let's go. What's that? Oh, ow! Another one. Oh no, this is it. This is it here. This thing. Look at it, it's like shooting shit at me. You know what? Like, 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 what do I do to deserve this guy's beef? You know what? Just, just because you did that. I got a sample again. No, 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 no. Mm. We just really need to go into a different. We, we, like, we did a different base. And the radio has got nothing to tell us at the moment. Right, I think. Uh, since I'm not too sure what's happening yet, I think this is probably a good point to end this first episode. Oh, hang on. First things first. Uh, eh. Confirmed you cannot you cannot kill the Skyray things. <laughs> and I've just screenshot. But anyway. Um thank you all for watching this video. I will try to get this video edited and uploaded as soon as possible. And I'll try and make videos whenever I can over the next few months. Hopefully whenever I've got more time off, I will be making videos. But um yeah, I'm going to carry on that make this a series, and once this is done, then we can carry on to the sequel. I've just realised as well that I've got a radio uh, thing that's come through in the right there, so we'll start off next episode by going and doing whatever that is. So, thank you all for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. Little, little, little cheeky birds.